Tell me what you've seen in terms of the growth and the participation. Well, I think it's grown in, in more ways than one. First of all, participation has gone from uh, you know the low hundreds to now the low thousands, so that's uh, one thing that's pretty impressive. I'd say it's increased by an order of magnitude in the five years that uh, it's been in existence. I mean, for example, you've got all these former presidents who are uh, there, people who are real practitioners who have great experiences to share. The fact of the matter is governments just can't do it alone. Uh, we don't want governments to be giant size. We don't want them to control the entirety of society. We want them to provide a framework within it which we can all uh, operate uh, freely. And therefore, by definition, um, if we're going to tackle some of the large problems of the day, we really have to do it together. Oh, well, we had a panel which had the former presidents of uh, Mexico, uh, Bolivia, and Colombia. And uh, we talked about uh, the real challenges facing uh, the whole hemisphere at the moment, both on the economic uh, and the growth side and on the political and social side. It was a really very, very good panel and clearly probably the foremost topic was the problem, the obstacle that countries like Venezuela uh, represents to the general progress uh, of the region. People uh, enjoyed it immensely. I think they were happy to see these former presidents close up, acting like you know, real human beings, thinking about real problems, and, and displaying, as you saw yourself, a, a very good sense of humor at the same time, d despite the gravity of some of the issues that we're confronting.